I am so sweaty. Five minutes and I literally turned to Emily and go, is this heated? I looked like I just came out of a waterfall and everybody else was dry. So that was, that was that. At least I know I'm hydrated. That was one of the hardest Pilates classes I've taken in a really long time. I think because she spent so much time focusing on core in the beginning that everything else just felt so hard afterwards. Went up to her afterwards and said, thank you so much for kicking my ass. That is a beautiful start to the day, ladies and gentlemen. But welcome back to my channel. I figured we'd do a few days in my life because I like hanging out with you guys and also we get to mix up the workouts a little bit it's different every day my day routine honestly switches depending on what I have going on so yeah this will be fun hanging out with each other for the next few days this week's theme is model I had a go macro photo shoot on Monday which was so beyond exciting I'll put some clips in from that it was just so so much fun and I had a blast and then yesterday I sat at my computer and edited for probably eight hours straight but today we're back out there I'm modeling for my friend's brand a Kasha Seamoss. You guys have seen me eat the Seamoss, use the spray, everything. Anna, I've mentioned her before. She's one of the greatest humans, I think, walking this earth. So, of course, I'm so excited to see her and squeeze her because I didn't get to see her for Pilates. It was also just her birthday, so we went to a birthday dinner for her on Monday, but I don't know. Clearly, I'm just obsessed with Anna. <laughs> Photo shoot is in Malibu. I need to drive back home and just start getting ready, shower, take care of Stella before I head out for the day because I don't know when we're coming back. Also, last night, I hyper-focused on my face, so... Just ignore what's going on. Not a good habit. It's not a good habit. And I'm so frustrated too because I was doing so good not touching my face. And then last night I stared at it for a little too long and was like, what if I just... And that's when you know. I just showered and did my makeup. I still have a few more things that I'm going to do once I get there. But I have an hour long drive so I don't want to do my lip liner and then have to retouch it and do the whole thing. I'm just packing up some clothes now for the shoot. She asked us to bring some changes. And one thing about me, if you ask me for options, I'm going above and beyond like this. I also need workout shoes. Okay, we're somehow going to carry this and this. Bada bing. Bada boom. Okay, we just got here. This house is absolutely beautiful. I just changed into our first outfit, just a little workout set. And this is Leo. Hi, Leo. <laughs> and uh, this is our closet today. We literally just unpacked all the bags on this table. It's chaotic, but girls will be girls. Say hi, Jackie. We can't wait. The Akasha Mama. The Sea Moss Mommy. Hi. Sea Moss Queen. Sea Queen. And the Zuma King. <laughs> Zuma King and Akasha Mama. Yeah, they started raining. Forget your capture drinks. It's like how are you using Kuna? Kuna's like 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 I've like I have eaten. I want to make letter. It's so adorable. He's so funny. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Great. I have a bigger one if you want, but I thought that would be. I'll start from. There's a slight drizzle, so my hair is so so curly. Akasha Superfoods Sea Moss Baby. Zinke. Anna says it's pronounced Zinke. Zinc or Zinke? Level. <laughs> it's almost as big as my uh... arugula, chicken, rice, and avocado. Hello. Obviously, we've made it back home. I am so tired, but I need to go on a walk to get my 10K steps for this January challenge, which I'm still going strong at. Thank you very much. I'll update you guys on that tomorrow. I don't have the brain power for that tonight, but we're gonna go get our steps in. I think I wanna practice some handstands when I come back and make some dinner, but we're gonna lay low and just do some chores for the rest of the evening. My front door's been open ever since I've been home, so. That's really good. I've been calling Stella's name for the past like five minutes and she won't come because she knows what time it is. Stella, come on. Let's go. 
Let's go. No. You trying to just make everything as difficult as it possibly can be. Should we go on a walk together? I just don't understand. Dogs are supposed to like walk. Woohoo! Go Stella! <laughs> Making my way downtown. Walking fast. Faces pass on. I'm so scared for tomorrow because my obliques. Oh, okay, Stella. Because my obliques are already so sore. Walking and laughing and it's only been 12 hours so tomorrow's gonna be spooky team we're heading into the last photo shoot of the week Woo! today i'm going to be helping erase skin therapy that's where i get my light therapy done i've been helping them with content here and there and more than happy to because they literally save my skin usually my legs are the number one spot and my armpits so fun i get it all up and down my leg it's healing right now so i just get these dark spots and then they take a really long time to heal but i had a flare up so you can see my knee is still a little bit red you know cheetahs used to be my favorite animal when i was little so i think i just manifested becoming one my eyelash curler and mascara are definitely in the car so i need to do that in there but i think i'm ready so yeah but after this one we can chill at home and edit and clean up and tidy and just get our life organized again so it'll be good and you know it's fun mixing up the routine every once in a while i'm here we're gonna do some more filming but i'm just doing my treatment really quickly and before your treatment begins in 10 seconds there is approximately three minutes of treatment remaining we're done, cowboys. I feel like you guys already know this, but if you don't, this sweat set is from TLF. It is so comfortable. These shorts, one of the best things on this planet. They're seriously just the sweetest and cutest ever. We were taking some videos of the hand and feet machine. By the way, if you don't have psoriasis all over the body and you don't need the whole tanning bed thing, and you just get it on your hands and feet, they have things where you can just go into that. But they were so sweet and we were taking videos of my first photos I ever took when I first came here. Seeing those photos is such a good reminder of how far I've come because whenever I have a flare up, I'll think, like I've told you guys before, I'm not making progress or I'm still doing something wrong, but then I'll see those photos and it's just such a reminder of how far I've come and how much my skin has truly healed and how much my body has truly healed. Such a reassuring feeling. So I'm very, very happy. All right, our modeling week has come to an end. That was so much fun. I just tried to kind of recreate that bowl from yesterday. Brown rice, arugula, avocado, but I did ground turkey and then I topped it with some pesto on there. She's not the prettiest, but she is delicious. Outside break, always a mandatory. Pesto. Time to lock myself back in my room and edit for six hours. People just really make me laugh sometimes. I went to the grocery store to get water. I'm carrying this whole thing, which obviously is not light. And these two ladies try to stop me to talk to me, and I'm like, like out of breath. <laughs> and I'm a people pleaser, so I'm I will sit for the conversation. I will not interrupt you. I'm holding the box like this. She tries to hand me something, and I go, oh, I make that noise. She tucks the paper in my hand, in between the box, <laughs> in between the box and my hand. <laughs> And I just think that we should all hire this lady as a saleswoman because she, she does not quit. I got a package from Coconut Colt. That's like the best news ever. They came out with a new flavor. There is no way. Cinnamon churro. You are lying. They also sent a little bag of churro chips from Siete. Amazing ingredients. And another one, probably because they know I'm going to inhale this in the next three days. You know me, we do not wait. You know who has the best churros? Disneyland. Oh, this one really reminds me of cheesecake. The texture of everything really, really reminds me of cheesecake. 
God, I love when people make healthy things taste unhealthy. Oh, wow. Thanks, Coconut Cult, for blessing my day. This is what equipment they have access to. You know, this is what their goals are. I think it's good to start with. Like, I'm thinking... Just, like, because you, you, you enjoy it so much, it's going to be so fun. And yeah. It's going to be so fulfilling. Hi, Vloggy Pods. Welcome in. Join in. Sophia Join in. is just being the best human being ever and helping me with work. You're not ready. You guys are not ready for what's coming. I'm, I'm crying. I'm screaming, crying, throwing up. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be amazing. <laughs> oh yeah, vitality. Oh, I need to take these pads out. Is I never like wearing the pads. Oh my gosh, she is just so cute. Code Tamer, baby. You know the drill. I'm pretty sure I'm working out with one of the trainers, so hopefully I don't have to think and he can take me through his workout. I always love that. I mean, of course I love my workouts, but it's always nice not having to think about your own. And I feel like I always learn something when I work out with somebody new. This has been my favorite deodorant for a while now. It does not irritate me whatsoever, and we are really obsessed with it. It also kind of has that like manly smell, you know, yummy. Guess I let my feelings take control Guess I let my demon take the wheel Used to think that we'd be wrong I can't believe that it was real It was back in late December when I did I just wish I could forget Cause I had how much I love it Oh, I hate how I just love to catch a feel Yeah I've been wasting my time I don't know why I can't get you out of my mind I, you know what's funny too is I was watching it slowly, but I don't think my brain's on enough yet to really have that reaction time. So I just kept watching it and then I was like, oh, it overflowed. Because I can imagine if I was you, I would have been looking at the center and being like, well, this is cool. That's exactly oh, the whole thing? Oh my. Oh my god. The whole damn. Holy shit. I think that I look like a naked mole rat when my hair is slicked back like this. Um, but I also feel like everybody feels that way, so I feel like we just have to own it. I think I'm gonna go to the gym today and film an in-depth back and bicep workout for you guys. I remember just how helpful those videos were when I first started out in the gym. Some things can be so confusing even when they're simple, so having someone slow it down so much and just explain it makes everything so much easier. Before I go though, I did get invited to a cute little event in Santa Monica, so I'm gonna try to stop by there before we head to the gym. I am. You're actually in this vlog twice now. <laughs> really? Because it's a few days, <laughs> and so I did the photo shoot. <laughs> Say hi to Anna again. Hi. Anna's vlog, we're just living in we're it. Back. <laughs> I don't know the wall is. <laughs> Another all this thing. Yeah, well, I was there already. I literally got so deep in work. Why is LA actually hilarious? The workout is done. It should be uploaded already onto YouTube. So if you're curious about it, go check it out. It's an in-depth back and bias workout. So whenever I do those, it's so refreshing for my own mind. And I also know that going into the gym can be so intimidating. So I just want to be that personal trainer in your pocket. You can bring it with you or you can just watch it beforehand so you have it all pre-planned out. The last thing that should be keeping you from your goals and getting to the gym is embarrassment. Everybody starts somewhere. Everyone has to figure out their form. Everybody makes the same mistakes. The more planned and your workout is, 
the more confident you will be going into the gym. I am so tired and so, so hungry and honestly, so hangry right now. LA traffic tests every single nerve in my body. I need to start keeping a Go Macro emergency stash. Usually I always have one, but right now I don't and I'm worried about everyone's safety around me. How many red lights? I literally, how many red lights? I made the choice to move here. <laughs> everyone and that's only good evening from LA it's about mid-morning mid-afternoon here in Australia we're about to do a little sign off I hope you've enjoyed watching this video thank you so much um comment below what your favorite moment was my favorite moment I think was when Tamara did like a handstand and she actually did really well with it I think that was really cool so thank you so much for watching and again peace and love see you in the next one bye guys